into the castle now yes. and my will be our tour guide. I'm completely obsessed with this castle so uh, I'll be the tour guide. <laughs> and we're really looking forward to it because it looks super beautiful even from the outside so I'm guessing it's much beautiful from the inside. It's so beautiful. It's Cornwall Castle by the way and it's amazing and you guys should visit it if you're in Denmark. It's so good. It's definitely worth the trip and the weather is amazing. Yes, look at this blue sky. Welcome to Basic Cornwall <laughs> Knowledge with my This is Cornwall Castle, a UNESCO World Heritage Site from I think it was year 2000 It was named UNESCO World Heritage Site Namely, it's where the Shakespeare play Hamlet takes place and what we know about the historical figure Hamlet, he also lived here um, It was originally built in 1420 um, by Erika Pommern who was actually German technically, I think to uh, get taxes across this narrow body of water. But then in the late 1500s, Queen King Frederick II he moved here and he restored it for him and his wife. I think she was called Matilde, I'm pretty sure. And they had like, they were known for their super happy marriage, which is really cute. They wrote a lot of letters to each other. They had like 10 children and they just really loved each other. And they brought life back to the castle and they also built what was for many hundreds of years, the biggest ballroom in Northern Europe, which has these checkered floors and it's really, really beautiful. And it's been open to the public since 1938. And it went from being um, a royal residence in mid 1700s, and then it turned into <laughs> a place where people run through as you're telling historical facts. Um, there he is. And it went, to like a <laughs> it went forward to being like a military place, and then they left the place in 1991, and now it's just a museum. And it's really beautiful and well preserved, and I love it. And we missed it again because. <laughs> well, we, we got to see all the parts of it that are free, so that's a lot of things like the battlements here. Okay. Yes. Um, and the towers and everything but there are also the dungeons we didn't get to see the dungeons but that also means that we come or we have to come again you have to come back so, and go inside yes. and we'll do it in the summer when it's not so cold yes <laughs> but you should film uh, see how close sweden is that's sweden there's right sweden there. and there's that <gasps> <That's me. laughs> and there's leon and there's leon Just ahead the shooting. There were so many beautiful pictures, so you guys will see them later. They're all amazing. Yes! yes. Have you heard? Mm -hmm. <laughs>
actually been here for a few days now and we spent our weekend here, Leon and I. Yay. And we thought uh, we are just coming from a photo shoot, by the way. That's why we are so much. That's why we look amazing. No? And look at our super cool mugs. These okay. are Lisa Parker mugs and I have like a small collection because I love how they're like new age ugly. <laughs> so I think it's really cool. <laughs> they are. In a beaut in an amazing kind of way, so windy. I cannot even hold the camera right. But yeah, we are going to see another castle. What's this castle called, Leon? We will be leaving in a few hours and uh, yeah, Maya is feeling a bit sick today so we wouldn't want to, <laughs> to annoy her with filming but uh, yeah, we had such a lovely time. We want to thank Maya and Asmus to have us over and it was so lovely to stay with you guys. Yeah. And yeah, you are always welcome at our home as well. And, yeah. Thanks a lot. Thank you.